Coming up next, a welterweight matchup between Tyron Woodley and Conor McGregor. So here is Conor McGregor making the walk once again, and absolutely remarkable what he has accomplished since making his UFC debut in 2013. Still the only simultaneous two-division UFC champion the promotion has ever seen. That left hand, whether you're a featherweight or a welterweight, you don't want to get hit with the left hand of Conor McGregor. He is precise, a creative striker who has certainly put Dublin, Ireland, and SBG, Ireland, on the MMA map. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan favorite combination. Well, for my money, he's as well-rounded as any fighter on the roster. The St. Louis, Missouri native, the chosen one, Tyron Woodley, realizing the UFC welterweight championship with a knockout of Robbie Lawler back at UFC 201, retaining the title with a five-round draw against Stephen Wonderboy Thompson. When Woodley is on, he is the best 170-pound fighter on the planet. This guy has world-class takedown defense. He is incredibly difficult to take down and once you do get him down, he gets back to his feet very swiftly. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. Woodley is six years his senior. The rest of the numbers are close. And now to get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC Welterweight Division. Introducing folks, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record on 21 wins, three losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of the blue And now we're his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 18 wins, three losses, and one draw. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of St. Louis, Missouri, USA. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time. will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch him up, man. We are underway. You ready? You ready? And we are underway. The buzz is palpable inside this arena. Oh! by that head kick. Tags him. 
McGregor gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Head kick attempt, unable to find the target. Oh, another head kick lands, and the question beckons Joe. How many more can this guy absorb before he gets knocked down or potentially knocked out? Wow. Well, that's how you draw it up. Nice trip to secure the takedown. Hard elbow to the body. Well, you don't want to spend too much time fighting off of your back, Joe, but pretty good work here from the bottom by McGregor. And now he's in north-south. Wow. Back up to the feet. Well, Joe, I know he's an offensive fighter, but he's going to have to figure some things out here defensively, moving forward and right into the straight punch there of his opponent. Oh, he missed that kick. Oh, and just out. like he's that, out. the fight is oh. over. Huge right hand shot that got him the victory. Yeah, Joe, a pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Let's see it one more time. Look at the power in this hook as it lands for the knockout. Great angle here. Boom! And he's out. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. All right, the official decision Ladies is in. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Buff. Has called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 45 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the notorious So the notorious Conor McGregor getting it done yet again. I am running out of superlatives when it comes to describing all this man has accomplished. People have doubted him. He mutes every naysayer every step of the way. And again, it doesn't seem to matter the challenge. They said the wrestler would be his kryptonite. The striker had too much power. Conor McGregor finds a way on fight night.